Well, we're here at Uncle Jack's. It's actually Grandpa. Whatever, Grandpa whatever. Grandpa Jack's. I'm uh, sorry, I was thinking of the love guru, because he, do, he does that whole thing where he's like, if, if your Uncle Jack helped you off an elephant, would you help your Uncle Jack off an elephant? Dude, that is the classic joke about helping your Uncle Jack mm -hmm. off a, a live animal. The love guru knew what was up. Can we also, can we talk about it? Louisiana just passed a, a, a law to ban sex with animals uh, 24 to 10? Years old? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> you can have sex with an animal as long as it's not between the age of, of, of 10, 10 and 24. 24. <laughs> um, no, they, 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 they passed a bill saying like, oh, you can't have sex with animals. And they passed it 24 to 10. That means 10 people voted against it. So good job, Louisiana. Very proud of you. Are um, they like, are they like, well, by what definition is an animal? Because now we have people calling it people Nazis that aren't Nazis. Are people going to start demon us animals and then we just can't fuck each other <laughs> is that what's gonna go on i just don't i, I just think words are very important i, I don't think that uh, and my dog uh, not necessarily an animal he's got feelings and shit he's a part of the family <laughs> <laughs> i could fuck him <laughs> i'm I mean, voting against this one i'm sorry i mean i, I pay for a roof over his head <laughs> I, I pay, pay his, for his vet food? bills his doctors his dental I should be able to fuck him. Just like I should be able to fuck my own kit. I mean, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. It's Louisiana for you guys. It's Grandpa Jack for you. It's Grandpa Jack, dude. Uh, well, I'm sure you'll find something to put him off after all. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Okay, so there's a vampire I have to scare off. Um, but that's what I got this garlic here for. Um, and for those wondering who's breathing into the mic, it's the air conditioning unit. Yeah. Uh, so we just want to be comfortable. So this is the comfortable episode. So you guys can complain, and we know you won't because every time we say you would complain, you're like, we don't mind. We just like hearing you boys. And, and like then we, that you boys are comfortable. We just look like assholes. Yeah. Or it's like, wow, we, you know, uh, because well, they, people complain on the internet. It's it's not it's it's not like a. I think we're just trying to be safe about it. We're trying to be safe, but in the end, we just look like a couple of assholes. Ryan, are you ready to fucking win this fishing hunt? No, 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 no. Oh. Not, don't be ready to die, dude. Okay. Ready to live and play more old school RuneScape. The only reason I am currently alive is old school RuneScape. Like, the fact that it exists is the only reason I am living today. Dude, I don't, I honestly don't think I'd still be alive if it weren't for old school Rune. Honestly, okay, think about the butterfly effect. During your time of playing old school RuneScape, you pro, like, your life would be completely different if you hadn't played old school I might RuneScape. have gone out and played outside and gotten run over by a car or become paralyzed from the waist down because some dude threw a sickle at my back? Absolutely, but instead you're inside playing old school RuneScape. <laughs> I like thought of some dude in his, in his front yard in South Carolina seeing a young boy play in the street, <laughs> getting so mad that he throws a sickle at him. <laughs> Gah! <laughs> ah! I've never even seen a sickle in real life. What? you never seen a big old sickle? What are they? I've seen sickles on like, like in <laughs> communist imagery. That's the only place I've ever Grim seen a sickle. The Reaper holds a sickle. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, that's a scythe, actually. That's a scythe, But it's yeah. a long sickle. I guess it's, I guess a scythe is a long sickle. It's a sickle with a long stick. Like like have you ever have you ever like seen a, a sickle outside of like the Soviet Union's flag? Hmm. Oh, check this out, Ryan. Oh, he was gonna win the fishing contest, sinister stranger, but he, he's clearly a vampire. So <laughs> yeah. I got a little garlic. I put it in. Ooh. I put it in the pipe of this building. Now he's smelling it, and he's like, "Oh, I don't. I'm gonna move over here instead." What is that stinky smell? Yeah, so I'm gonna go take the area by the pipes now that I chased him away. And guess what, Ryan? This is the we're gonna catch a garlic fish. This is, this is where we're gonna catch the secret fish. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this. Uh oh, look at with him. my my fishing rod. God, he's got a nice fishing rod too. Look, he how has big a really is. nice fishing is our rod. Our fishing rod big or is it small? Check this out. We got a big. Oh, fish. I'm, I'm baiting the fishing rod. Check that out, dude. That bends a little. That's that's some good girth to it. Am I gonna catch the magic special fish I'm supposed to catch for this one? Come on, come on, come on, catch that shit. You caught three giant carps. Okay, let's see who caught the biggest fish. Ready? We did, we did, we did. We I caught think, three giant we, carps. We caught the biggest fish. Please. Let's see. You hand over your catch. We have a new winner. Yes. Uh oh! Yes! Oh! Ah! Yes! So, like, I've kind of lost the ability to do my scream. Like, ah, oh, fuck, it hurts to do. I can't even try. I got to that point. I don't even try anymore because it felt so uncomfortable to try to do my little high-pitched scream that I used to do in it elementary just, school. It just hurts, man. Like, I just can't do this, like the scream I used to be able to do. That's a sign of being an adult, Matt. I know. It, that's one of those sad signs of being an adult, you know? It's like, oh, oh man. I can't scream like a high-pitched, small, young girl anymore. Well, that, I, I, I took that with pride. That was something <laughs> I was known for. That was like, that was like part of my, of my personality, Ryan. It's like if I forgot to laugh. Exactly, you know? It's like, I don't know how to laugh anymore, you know, Matt. How you do got, you laugh? You got your laugh, I got my scream, Ryan. Without my scream, what? 
what what am I gonna be? Skinny. Well, I'm working on it. I'm 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 gaining weight. Actually, I haven't. I stopped going to the gym and drinking my my protein shake. So okay. Uh, I need to get. I was actually planning on getting back on that tonight. Going okay. to the gym you for should. the first time. You should send me pictures and Snapchats so you can prove it to your. So you can prove me wrong that I think that you're not gonna do it tonight. Okay. Thank you. You're helping me out with motivation. That really means a lot. Thanks, bro. Do you want Do you want me to be clothed in those pictures or? Well, I mean, do you have like a like a tank top of some sort? I got it. That yeah, you I could got it. like maybe it's a little like you're stretching so it like lifts a up bit a bit of a crop so, top. So I can see that V. That V pointing down. That Calvin Klein model V. Yeah, yeah, sure, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I got you. Want me to send you pictures of my stretch marks? Please. Please. <laughs> my cousin got stretch marks because he, uh, when he hit puberty, he grew so fast. He got stretch marks from growing tall so fast. I got stretch marks, some, like, near my armpits. I got some on my waist, and I got a few on my butt. Dude, stretch marks go away. Get, Do uh, they? I thought they are scars. No, you can actually get get some uh, get some coconut oil. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. Get some coconut oil every day. Massage it with coconut oil, okay. and they'll go away after a while. I'll, I'll listen to you there, and I will also listen to the people in the comment section who can give me advice on how to get rid of stretch marks. So when I become nice, fit, and sexy all around, I can go to Muscle Beach and punch everyone in the face. God, we got to go make a video at Muscle Beach, dude. <laughs> we got to just go get Speedos and go make a video at Muscle Beach. Like my first, th my first celebration. Uh, <laughs> of getting rid of my stretch marks is picking fights with the strongest people in California. <laughs> <laughs> Go to Muscle Beach where those guys are like jacked up on steroids and protein powder. And where then, their job is essentially like Instagramming like, their muscles. Protein shakes. Yeah, yeah. They get like sponsors. Dude, why why don't we have a G Fuel sponsorship yet? I don't know. Wait, you, th wait. you think they I mean we're we're gamer bros. You think they'd come after us. You need that gaming energy. Come on, we're the we're the game bros. Come on. Game dudes, and we are so rude. Dude, we, we are the <laughs> yeah, gamers with that's the bad a attitude. Thing. The game dude. The g he is a game dude, and he is so rude. He is a gamer with a bad attitude. See, I don't know the lyrics that much. I just kind of, dude, I'm fucking Cyclops from X Men. Ryan, no one. That doesn't. That only makes sense to me. Because Fine, let me take a picture. And you're you're gonna you. put it in the episode. Am I? I mean, Am I, Ryan? Maybe. All right, we'll see. Well, we got. Make your joke make sense. Let's see it. Okay. I'll send this picture to you. <laughs> That's a good picture. I'm getting attacked by wolves and shit. Damn it, Michelle. I, I, I tried to do Barack Obama's voice, got mixed up, did, <gasps> did, did Hank Hill's voice, and said, damn it, Michelle is Hank Hill. If Hank Hill was black, he, he'd sound like Obama. Oh, he would. Definitely. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, no, get out of here. Stop. There's ice warriors. What are oh, you doing? No, you, I can see through them. Mama's boy is a fucking idiot they sometimes. They have no with organs. The pathfinder. I know. It's just ice. It's nothing but ice. That means they're not living creatures. It's just magic making inanimate ice move around like people. Well, it's RuneScape. Oh, that is true. It is a fictional game in which... Oh, wow. Dude... Oh, and for a lot of people have been saying that we can like full screen this game and get rid of this this HUD. This Why overlay. would we do that? I'm just saying I want to keep it because I like it for the nostalgia aspect. It doesn't feel like old school RuneScape if it if it doesn't have all this, you know. We don't want to play no four four K HDR RuneScape. No, absolutely not. You know, if I wanted to, I would, but I I don't want to. I I like I honestly like no joke. I love games that have like a layout like this. Like I love this kind of nostalgic, uh, like interface that that kind of blocks most of the screen it just it's comforting you know it's like a nice comfortable feel it's like everything happens right here it feels good you don't there's less screen to keep track of i get horny oh, looking at that. it okay you ready for this dude ready for what you ready ready christmas re trees dude you ready for me to finish this quest dude i have been ready for you to finish this quest since the day i was born are you serious yeah that's all i could think about when i came out of the pussy all right dude <laughs> austri said have you won that's yet that's awful Ugh. coming out of pussy yeah but i'm t your mom's pussy? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my mom's vagina. <laughs> anyway, uh, yes, we just won the fishing contest. Well done. That's brilliant. Do you have the trophy with you? Yes, I have it right oh, here. Oh, now we can use this stupid little house thing. Yes, we did the quest. Please tell me we get to keep that trophy. We can look at it whenever we want. No, he stole it. He, what? We had to give it to him. But look how much fishing XP we got. We got a quest point, and we got access to the tunnel shortcut. Now we have a total of two quest points. Where will the tunnel take us, though? The, we don't have to go through the mountain anymore. <gasps> This quest gave us access to use this little house to cut to the other. So basically, we go from here to here. Can we can we just do that right now? Just because it's it's it'll it'll 
feel it'll, it'll feel good. Yeah. yeah. It'll feel Wait, good. We, we got to level up fish points. Uh, watch this. Ready? 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 There's yeah. Wait for it. Wait for it. Fishing is now 18. Ooh. Boom, dude. We just leveled up. Level 18 fishing. Our fishing level is old enough to fuck. There is uh, one of these browsers had an ad that just played and made some made some sounds, so I had to close it. <coughs> okay. You want to you want to test out the tunnels, dude? Yeah. Just climb down. Oh, Ooh, let's damn. See him, him, come on, dude. Was that from Gremlins 2? No, that's uh by Kate Bush. Oh. Uh, Wuthering Heights. Good song. And now, uh, Wuthering oh shit, Heights. can I, can I take this? Can I take this? Train cart? Ready? Oh, come on. Are we gonna... Dude, this is like Minecraft! Are we gonna ride it? Okay, well, we gotta visit Keldegrim before we can ride the God minecart. damn so, it. Wow, this game. Wow, RuneScape. So, I'm just trying to get from point A to point B. Don't make me do all this stupid shit. So we can enter the shortcut, we just can't use it? No, I think we, I think we can walk around these tunnels and get to where we need to be. Oh. Let's explore it, dude. Okay. Can we, you, you wanna kill dwarves and level up? Uh, Let's grind a little bit, dude. Okay. I'm gonna kill him. Ready? Yeah. I mean, they all might start attacking you. Uh, there's not there's not multiple animal attacks in this game, I don't think. Or at least not at this point. Look at him. Oh, shit. We're gonna kill him. We're gonna murder him in his house. Killing fucking Keemstar right now, dude. Wait, where? What's Keemstar up to these days? He's still... He is a no-man. He's digging a hole. Diggy, diggy hole. Just Keemstar, diggy, Keemstar, diggy, Keemstar diggy. Dude, Keemstar joined Yogg's cast. <laughs> I want Keemstar to come out with a with an album, much like Eminem, and try to redeem himself. He did. He released some songs. He has a couple songs. Uh, there's the classic song "Dollar in the Woods," but then he's done some other songs. Wow. Uh, That's take, what he sounded like. Get some bones. I'm gonna bury these bones, get my prey level up, and I'm gonna kill him too. I just wanna <laughs> I just wanna aimlessly take life. So there's no there's nothing bad happens when you kill good guys in this game. No. Oh, and it's I, literally just do whatever you want. It's it's a lawless land. It is a lawless land. You know, I can go up. I, I can kill. In fact, when you go to Verak, it, there's a bunch of, like, guards everywhere for the city, and you can just kill them just endlessly. What are those things? It says you have three of them. They look weird. I don't know what these they are, are. These are the red vine worms that I had to use for oh, fishing. Yeah. I'll examine it for you. It says wormy. Ooh. I wish my job was just to come up with the descriptions for items in this game. That'd be beautiful. Man, Ryan, I'm so happy we completed that quest. And now we can... Uh, do other stuff too, like uh, find a girlfriend. You want to go do that right now? Girlfriend? You want to go work on it? Let's let's at least try to get one. All right, let me let me kill let let's, me kill this let's guy. Let's try another time. You know, the more you try, the more you succeed, right? That's true. So statistically, if we keep trying to get a girlfriend over and over, eventually someone's gonna take it. Okay? Yeah. Well, guys, uh, we finished we finished another quest in this episode, and in the next one, we're gonna go uh, begin our quest to maybe uh, talk to some ladies here and there. Oh wait, let me go get this dwarven stout. Take a, take a sip of this stout over Stupid here. Stupid dwarven piece of shit. Let me, uh, ooh, it's black, dude. Ready? Drink that dwarven stout. Oh, come on. Wait. Oh! Drink, 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 drink. He drank it. Oh. He drinks it like instantly. Oh, look at him walking around all drunk. Doom, 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 doom. Oh, look at him, dude. He's having fun. I love that there's golden brew in his glass mug. Well, it doesn't make sense if that's golden because the the, the dwarven stout is like black almost because a, stout, a stout's a real dark beer. Ready? Ready? Drank it. Ooh. Can you get drunk in this game and walk all goofy? Is that a pilot? Why is there a pilot down here? Captain Ninto? <laughs> Wait, talk to Captain Ninto real quick. Hey, buddy, come here. What's up? Hello, what are you doing here so far from home? Look oh at this. My. Stop, Outlook! You're not even open! I'm enjoying the local hospital. Oh, hospital. He's drunk. He's very drunk. Hospitality. Looks like you've enjoyed more than your fair share of hospitality. <laughs> I probably shouldn't drink right now, but this dwarven beer is kind of more after the fifth pint. Fifth pint? Jesus. I'd go, I go easy on the dwarven stout if I were you. I used to be tax pilot, you know? I used to be a real hero. But I locked my bottle. Scott needs to find Scullis in the bottle. <laughs> okay, see ya. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> The fucking asshole. Was that the beginning of a quest? MAGA. MAGA. <laughs> <laughs> Sir? <laughs> you know, here's this thing about Hillary Clinton. <laughs> yeah, I wish he started saying Let me tell you that. some bullshit about those fucking emails. Alright? <laughs>